For the outfit of the week, I put out the all-time favorite, the trench coat, the ultimate spring summer jacket. <laughs> you see it all over Instagram right now again. But yeah, it is just the perfect jacket for now. You just feel so like springy. It immediately puts me always in a good mood when I put on a trench coat. Uh, this trench coat is from ASOS. You got this one on some kind of sale. <laughs> I don't know anymore. Underneath I wore a like, wool dress with a little turtleneck from Kos. Then the bag is from AS Glo. Really, really nice. Vegan leather and you can fit just the essentials in there and it's just really, really handy if you just want to, you know, have your hands free and just have still all the stuff you need with you. Then my Celine sunglasses again and then for shoes I'm wearing my Margiela sneakers. This is really what I call like your ultimate spring outfit. Trench coat, still a knit dress because yeah, you don't want to freeze and then pop on some sunglasses and you're done. Barcelona <laughs> and this time of year I always do like a different kind of makeup look like the right term is the no makeup makeup look and I'm gonna show you what I'm doing to achieve this look this is really my go-to summer look because in summer I just don't want to have a lot of products on my face and also, I don't know, you're just feeling a little bit more natural during summertime. I don't know if I'm the only one, but I just want to put on less and less during summer. But yeah, it's always nice to have a little bit to like highlight the new features, you know. So I'm going to show you my no makeup makeup look today. So I already did all my skincare and the next step and the first step is to use the Chanel Le Beige Water Tint and yeah I just love this product it's just it's like those little pigments in water and they just dissolve on your skin and just gives your skin like a really nice glow and just evens out your skin tone a little bit. It doesn't have a high coverage. I also bought it in a shade darker than my skin tone to just get a little bit of the summer tan already. So I'm gonna pump it into my hand. So you can also apply this with a brush but I recently just tried it out with my hand and I like it better. Just don't really like brushes and then you just go in. Yeah, like you see, it really just gives a really nice tint, but not too much, really subtle and a nice glow. So I really love a good glow. So then I already prepped my under eye area with some eye cream and then we're gonna go in with some concealer. And at the moment I'm using the Givenchy concealer in color 9. 
So what I would do is like three little dots here in like the corner of my eyes and three little dots here. Normally you would do like this triangle of light, but if you want to keep it a little bit more natural and also just lift your eyes a little bit, you just put it more in the corner of the eyes and bring it all up here because that way you naturally lift your eyes. look much more fresher and lifted and the next step is some blush and I'm using the Bobbi Brown Pot Rouge really really nice color and yeah I'm just gonna put it on my cheeks but I put it a little bit more up again to get like this lifting effect and also we are wearing a mask most of the time now so I'm gonna avoid it to bring it all down here where the mask is because I don't want to get pimples so I put it really high on my cheeks actually, not too much, and just work it in with your finger. Then I also put a little bit on the bridge of my nose. And since this is a lip and cheek tint, we are also going to put it on our lips. Now for brows, I do the usual. I use my MAC called Shape and Shade brow tint in color top and I will do this just really quick and for brow gel again I'm using the Ico brow gel still my favorite really really amazing so now there's only one step left and we're gonna bring a little bit of highlight in the corner of our eyes I will not Put highlight up to here because as you can see, hope it shows up on camera. I already have a nice glow here, so I don't need more fake highlighter. I have my natural highlighter. But I will use this Bobbi Brown like eyeshadow stick in color gold and pink, and I will bring it in the corner of my eyes. And then on top of this, because this is more like a creamy eyeshadow and it will basically fade away in a few hours when it's really really warm, I will go over with another highlighter and I use uh, the Becca one. This is like a nice golden color. And also bring this in the corner of my eye. So yeah, that is me done. <laughs> So really, really quick and easy makeup look, really easy to replicate. You can use, of course, your own products you already have. And yeah, it's really easy, it's natural and perfect for spring summer. So I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you're all doing well and I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye.